Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Stoke here. And hey, listen guys, I know a lot of y'all, including myself, we all got the PS5. It, it just got released today. Some of us got it early, some of us got it today. Hey, but like, I know, and if y'all are experiencing no HDMI signal or a display on your 1080p monitor, again, I'm gonna re repeat this. This is only for those who got a 1080p monitor or 1440p, all right? Uh, the issue you're gonna run into is two things is one is you're gonna try to hook up your ps5 to your elgato and, I, and the elgato that i am uh currently using is a elgato 4k uh capture mk2 all right that's what i'm using and guys listen if you just try to plug it straight up into there you will not get a display okay so what you're going to do is and what i'm going to show you all real quickly is Hook your PS5 up into uh, into your TV or a separate monitor. Now go into your Elgato, hook it directly up to either of those two sources, okay? And once you do that, and you go through all your settings, the, the update and everything that's gonna uh, guide you through on the PS5, go into your settings here. And once you get into your settings, what you wanna do is you wanna go into system, all right? Go into system and then go to your HDMI. All right, there are two uh, things that are uh, listed. Enable HDMI device link, it's already enabled. What you wanna uh, disable is the HDCP. Again, you want to disable the HDCP. It's already gonna come enabled already. You wanna disable this, that way you can get a a, uh, a display, especially for those who do stream, you're gonna get a, a display in the preview wi window of your Streamlabs or your OBS, whatever your, uh, whatever, uh, streaming platform you're using okay you will get that preview uh in that window of that all right that's the first step okay this and then that listen this is what drove me crazy because even though i got the preview in my stream lab i could not get a preview via the monitor all right so this is where you're gonna have to go ahead once you get us uh, logged in you uh disable the atcp Okay, what you got to do next is, guys, you got to go into your screen and video tab. Screen and video tab. And you go into your video output, and it's going to automatically show that your output, right now, I already changed mine already. But it's going to already have it on automatic mode, and automatic is going to have it displaying 4K. And if you don't have a monitor that, is, uh, that can handle 4K, then it's not going to display a HDMI. It's not at all. I'm telling you all, you're going to drive yourself crazy. Like I said, once you do, you're gonna already, you're gonna watch it for yourself. Go inside, go inside your resolution, it's gonna show 4K. What you're gonna do is go inside your uh, resolution underneath video output information, okay? And then you're going to select 1080p or whatever monitor uh, you have, you're gonna select that. And for me, I have a 1080p monitor. So I, once I selected it, you know, and then, and then it worked. It's that simple, God. It's really that simple. Those are the two things you have to do. Disable the HDCP. And once you do that, you're gonna go inside your screen and video, and then go to your resolution and change it to whatever resolution your monitor is. You have a 720, 720p monitor, then switch it to that, and then you will get that display. Because right now, since it, uh, by the PS5 being 4K, and you have a, a, a 4K capture, uh, capture card, it's gonna push out a 4K, and then your 1080p monitor is not gonna recognize that. Okay, guys, I really hope this video did help you all, and if it did help you all, it'd be greatly appreciated. Y'all, up that like button. If you are new to the channel, you wanna come through for more or content, go ahead and stop that subscribe button as well, and turn on post notifications. That way, you get notified every time I do upload new content. If y'all wanna come to my live stream. Hey, I do live stream on Twitch every single day from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. And then, hey, hey, everybody, y'all go slow and play out in this new Cold War. I want everybody to have fun. And I really hope these two tips really help y'all out to get gaming on y'all new PS5. One love.